I remember last year, uh, November 14th, I uploaded a video and I was talking how God gave me a new strategy. And that strategy was BWA. I had fasted for 21 days and God, in the second day, actually, I got a revelation and the Holy Spirit himself taught me that strategy. Let me tell you, one year down the line, now it's November 15th. I'm here again to testify that I've seen God doing wonders in my life and I have a new strategy. I have shared here, but it didn't have a name. Now this strategy, it has a name. It's called OPT Strategy. OPT Strategy is our new strategy. I remember back in 2021 when I was trying to tell God what is happening, why can I not make money, and God gave me WBB Strategy. So we have graduated from WBB Strategy to BW strategy and then this year God gave me CRB strategy, CSB strategy and all these strategies I thank God why because they are here to help us to be able to be profitable traders and as you are profitable traders one way will be a successful trader. So this is lesson 80 and this lesson I really feel so much grace. I really feel that God has given me this opportunity to share his word. As much as I'm a Forex trainer, I think all of you, you might, um, you have to understand that I'm a voice of God to the generation to come. Not only don't look at me and see Forex alone, you should look at me and see the reflection of God. You should look at me and see the God grace in my life from a home stay, from a stay home mom to a Forex trainer, from nothing, to something from grass to grace, from not having fear or, or air time to call or not having clothes to go to church or not having food for my children. And all this just happened like four years ago. And now having a sustainable income, I can trade, I can I can train, I'm doing other businesses through the power of God. I, I think it's a, it's a message for you to understand. You know, sometimes you open to listen to a video and of course the sound that is teaching, it has to be the right sound. Before we do the lesson 80 as I introduce this strategy, I want the sound that I'm releasing to be the right sound. First of all, if you have come with a heavy heart, may that heavy heart be over. May you be released. May you feel the weight gone just by listening my voice and listening because this is not my only voice. It's a voice that has been impacted by the Holy Spirit. This week has been good for us, for my student, for you guys who followed my signals. And it is just to show you that God has a lot for you. For what God did for us, you know, when you are trading against the dollar, it is a very tough moment. But all the analysis that I did from gold, GBPUSD, USD, every analysis I did, in fact, it favored us. Even the USD card. You remember the USD card that I was telling you uh, from some broker, it has broken. The others, it has not broken. Even that, it has obeyed. So we first give thanks to God. For this far we have come. If you have done lesson 80, do you think it is in vain? Do you think it is your own power? It is not your own power to keep listening to me. Even I know some people listen to me at night when they are supposed to be sleeping. What are you doing? You are you are cultivating. You What you are doing, you are planting. And the time for harvest, when it comes, it will be easy for you to, to harvest everything. So I just want to do a prayer before we do this video knowing that I'm introducing a new strategy, knowing that I'm giving you a gift. A God gave me and I gave you a gift. So Father God, I want to thank you for everyone who will listen to this video. I don't do this because I'm coerced or I'm, I'm manipulated or I just feel like I do this because it's an instruction from heaven. Anyone who listens to my voice, if they if they feel weak, Lord, I pray strength in their lives. If they feel discouraged, I pray for encouragement in their life. If they feel they cannot move forward, if they feel they want to give up, this is the video that you have chosen for everyone who wanted to give up in Forex to listen, to know that God, you know them. There are people who have been crying because of losing account left, right, center, but you're telling them using this video that it is okay, that with this new strategy, if they can listen to this new strategy, can be 
a game changer in their lives. So God, I open the inner eyes. People have eyes, but many don't see. But if we have and we use our inner eyes, the eyes of our heart, using the Holy Spirit, we can be able to see the market. Father, I pray that they may have, uh, they may have the power to create this world. And we, we already know you're the one who give us the power to create wealth. So I take this opportunity to connect them to the grace, the grace that has made me make thousands of dollars. I connect them to that grace. Those people who have never made profit, let them, my God, by the time this year is ending, let them carry their testimony. And I pray, oh God, that these people will be like that one leper who came back to Jesus and said, thank you. Let them go to an altar and say, thank you, Jesus, for what you're doing. In Jesus' name we pray and believe. Guys, lesson 80, new strategy. So before we start this new strategy, what I've done, I don't know what the market holds for me. I've gone where I started Forex. Guys, I started Forex July 2020. That's when I started Forex trading. I didn't know anything. I didn't know about the candlestick. In fact, I started with Hakenish candles and I was doing indicators, uh, moving average, trend line. That was me back in 2020. So from July to December, those six months was trial and error. And then now 2021, I had now to ask God to come in. And that's when God gave me WBB strategy. So my first strategy ever to have was WBB strategy. So guys, OPT strategy has some rules and you have to understand that it comes with two versions. So there's the OPT free version, OPT, free version so i have the opt free version and i also and i also have opt paid version so opt paid version of course it will be in my course paid version so this one will be in my course so what i'm trying to do i have already it's it's the the the, the strategy is one pattern on one time frame so i have already done a module on that in my course having so much details that i have uh categorized here on youtube but what i'll do anything you know when you have a new strategy you keep adding rules you keep uh, adding, advancing. So if I advance, it will only be for the paid version. So you need to understand for the paid version students, you have to buy the course at $400. And this course is recorded. Once you pay this course, you can use the 12 modules that are in the course to benefit you. You can redo the videos. You can watch the videos every time. And what I, I, want, what I tell my students, once you buy this course, already you are a winner. Why? This knowledge I didn't teach myself. It is straight from heaven. You see the way you hear someone saying about something and then you come and teach. That's not for me. If I don't hear, I don't train. That's why sometimes I can run away from YouTube for three months and then I come back when I'm filled and the Holy Ghost has told me what to teach. So the OPT strategy is, there is the free version and that's what I'll be building on YouTube and there's the paid version. So maybe with time, I will try to, say the opt free version this is what you get and the opt version paid version this is what you get but i just want you to understand there are so many things that i will leave on the table uh, i will leave out of the table for the free version but even with the free version imagine you can succeed it's just like the way we use trading you if you're using trading you for free version you can still analyze the market you can still know where the market is going you don't need but that person who have chosen to pay a trading view website, that paid version, they get more benefits. So it's not like, oh, I don't have money. Already I'm giving you the free version. So let's discuss what's, what is OPT. So OPT strategy, OPT strategy, it means, it means one pattern on one time frame. So it means that if I have one time frame. If I have to look for a pattern, I need to find it on one time frame. So if I am trading double tops or I'm trading double bottoms, I need the double top to be on one time frame. I don't need the double top to be in multiple time frames. And this is where I now come, I lower my patterns. Remember, guys, I teach six patterns, but in this OPT strategy, I just want to fast back test and be better with double tops, double tops, 
and double bottom because that one now I have noticed how clear it is either um either on one time frame so double bottom so I will be focusing on double top and double bottom so I'm not saying you can't check other patterns but for me right now my focus in to understand in a deeper way the double tops and the double bottoms in a very deeper way so my strategy is one pattern on one time frame and it can be starting from all the way 30 minutes so the rule is the pattern can start from 30 minutes so you can find that when it comes to time frame it can start from 30 minutes so if it is 30 minutes it means it's not on one hour if it, the double top is on one hour, it means it's not on two hour. If the double top is on two hours, it means it's not on four hour. If the double top is on four hour, it means it's not on the daily. And that's how the strategy is. And then weekly and then monthly. Here you can see that this, this double top and double bottom, the OPT has now given me a chance to even teach people on lower time frame. Other strategies that I've done, I've never gone down like this. I have never, guys, I have never gone down to two hours, one hour. Like for me, I have strategies starting from four hours. But I think when you pray God to give you even strategy for lower time frame, he gives you. So if you want to test it that a double top is on five minutes, it's not 15 minutes. For me, I think it can still work. So it's you to identify that pattern that is only on one time frame. And like I've said, this pattern should be only on one time frame. So it will start from 30 minutes. So if this is my double bottom or my double top on 30 minutes, I need to flip on the, if that's my double let me delete that and take the. If this is my double top on 30 minute, and you see for double top, we have this is the first attempt, and we have this as our second attempt. What you need to understand is that if this is 30 minutes, 30 minutes, so where is the text? If this is 30 minute time frame, because it's our lowest time frame, I've seen this strategy working. If this is our 30 minute time frame, we don't need to see a double top on one hour. So what will happen, the market here where there is a green, you need, you see the market here, the reason why it's a double top, there was a green candle, there was a green candle followed by a red candle. That's what makes a fast attempt. For all, maybe it's a bearish angle, a red candle. So you have, you have a green followed by what? Followed by a red. So, excuse me, sorry for that. So you have a, a green candle followed by red. It makes your first attempt. So when another green candle again comes here, followed by red, followed by red, it will give you the second attempt. I'm just illustrating. Ah, supposed to be the other way. So if we have another green candle there, another one followed by red, that's how a double top always looks like. So it's a matter of green, red, it creates a resistance. And then we have another notice Double tops should not break the resistance. So you see these details are now taught in the course, but let me just say it for the purpose of everyone understanding what I'm trying to say. So the first attempt is green followed by red, you get your resistance. If the market comes to the same resistance, this one we call it first attempt. This we call it first attempt. And the second one, we call it second attempt. So second attempt is what brings a double top. In this case is a possible double top. So once you have something like this, once you have something like this, first attempt and second attempt, once you have first attempt, second attempt, you make a possible double top. Now, once you make a possible double top, 
you have to realize if it is in 30 minutes and I want to trade it from 30 minute time frame, I need to go on one hour and look, do I have a first attempt? Most of the time you will find the market on one hour, instead of giving us a red candle at the green, at the green line, the market looks like this. So this is your first attempt. When you look at one hour, there is no resistance. But when you look at when you look at um 30 minutes, there is resistance. This is what we mean. So when you come and check one hour, one hour, no resistance to give you a pattern, and the market was going up. And you see, let's say this market again went down and came down and then now it's coming up you see now when they are coming here yes you have a green followed by you have a green followed by red but the point is you have only so my session how is my session disconnected So what I'm trying to say, sorry about that. I was a bit distracted. What I'm trying to say is that when we talk of OPT, one time frame, there's a clear resistance area creating a double top that has first attempt and second attempt. And this other one on one hour, there is no first attempt. What you're seeing is this resistance created. So what I need to, you to understand is that the only thing that you need for this strategy to work is that one time frame you have a pattern, the other one you don't have. So I want us to try to backtest this strategy. I have told you, number one rule, it can go for 30 minutes, one hour. Considering, uh, consider the pattern on 30 minutes, it's not on one hour. If you trade on one hour, it's not on two hours. If you trade on two hours, it's not on four hours. And um, that can be so easy. And let me show you with what happened on gold. Is something that happened on gold and I think we can all relate. So let me go to gold so that I can show you what I mean. So if you check on gold on four hours, so this is our gold on four. I just want to emphasize that point. If you're about to, to, to trade, let's say this is what we are trading. If you are trading gold on four hour, and you spot a pattern. Now, this is a four-hour time frame. You spot this double bottom. You see, we have two support area that makes one support area makes a, a, a first attempt, second attempt, making a double bottom. So if you want to trade OPT strategy, you have first to work with this. These tools, they are called ellipse. So you have to mark the, with this ellipse. Why? Because now, because it's four-hour, we'll flip the higher time frame for from four hour is daily. If I go to the daily time frame, I only have one support zone. Can you see? This is what I mean. So from having a double bottom like this, you see I have only one support. So there's no way I can have a support area. So this trade seems to be so, so good. So if you're trading this double bottom, now, the advanced OPT that I will be training my students is how to be, you can spot this and you enter your buy because, of course, it has given you, but still you have to be very, very careful because as that market is going up, it can still activate a new OPT that is not on four hour. So the question is, are you so, um, are you so attentive on your chart? So yes, we have a, uh, a double bottom here that has OPT only on four hour. And then you have an entry here. The question is, will you get the targeted uh, the targeted pips? For so far you got 48 pips, will it, will it hit 146? So if you remain without flipping the pattern and you just continue, it will be a losing trade. So if you're waiting for the market to come to your half, next candle, the market, does not come to the half. In fact, the market go down. So the question is, why did we have the OPT and still it didn't work? This is how I can answer you. The OPT, yes, it was confirmed, but as we were confirming, we had a new OPT at two, two hours. So you can find you are working with OPT on four hour, but now we have a new pattern called double top 
only on two hours. Guys, have you seen what I've done? So this thing is so powerful. So by the time you get this OPT, this OPT on two hours, one pattern on only one time frame. So the, by the time you're getting the OPT here, you will just come and go to four hour and check. Are they really telling the truth? Can you see we have only resistance? So if you don't know the idea of OPT, that's why you have been losing money. Because yes, you're trading one pattern, but the market activates a new pattern that is not on one time frame. You need to understand once we have OPT, like this double bottom is very strong, but because you have now a new activated double top on two hours that is not on four hour, you still measure the same. You say, I will enter this trade if they do what? If they, if they, uh, eliminate this area so if my market breaks out of this zone and you see you can also get opt around here so all this zone is a zone that you will you will uh be avoiding so you can say i will put my buy sides around this half so at least my first trade will be at 1955 but if they break that half i will come out so you you are waiting for your order to be activated to get to a, a buy trade because even this OPT, the double top can change to be a cap and handle. So there are so many possibilities. And that's why I tell people, Forex is not manipulated. It's just that it is information that has been hidden from your eyes. So the OPT can be a cap and handle to complete the double bottom that was only on four hour. So the buyers, the bankers and the market movers, they have higher chances of either buying or selling. If they buy, they will buy because of OPT on four hour and OPT on two hours, which has turned to be cap and handled. If they continue selling, they have an evidence. We are selling because there is a double top that is not on, on four hour time frame. So if we get an entry, we will sell. So if you if you put your buy order at the half, let's see when it gets activated. So the market has not activated yet and your order is activated. By the time your order is activated, you come back and check this chart, already half has been broken. So what do you do? You exit that trade and you enter the sale. Why are you entering the sale? Because you are targeting up to the neckline. And that's what the market did. After that, the market continued and went to the neckline. And again, neckline was violated. So there is power between a double bottom that has not broken half to a, a, a double bottom that breaks half. If you have two double bottom, one breaks half and the other one does not, the one that has power is the one that has broken half. If you have two double bottoms, both of them have broken half, but the first one starts with the neckline, the neckline has the power. So this one seemed to be a small double top, but there is the fact that it broke half and continue breaking the neckline, it was to complete this pattern. So there are two ways to, to, to trade a complete double top. The first and the most guaranteed take profit is half. So the, so I'm trying to show you uh, how OPT works. So that is what OPT means. So the market, the first take profit should be at that level because TP2 is never guaranteed. Now I want to show you what happens. So if you if you have this, this is a green, uh, what's a green? This one is the green one, the take profit. So let's see, if you enter a sell now, if you enter a sell now, will you get to 88 pips? So you see the market continues and it hits the take profit. The question is, by the time the market was coming up, so you can see the market comes up. I just want to play it quickly. So by the time the market is coming up, it is ranging at this area. So the market has activated that market and now it's going up. And the question is, how would you trade this market? You see from, from, the, from the two, from the four hours, even the double bottom that you knew it has been violated, but the market has broken a resistance area, but there's nothing, you, you can't trade it because they don't have a pattern. You go to two hours and you're thinking there's no pattern. You go to one hours and you think there's no pattern because if this was to be a double top, it has been violated by this green candle. But wait, you go to that minute. That's why I'm telling you this market and this strategy 
it is working even 30 minutes. So gold, I, I, I wish I did the gold analysis. I wanted to do gold analysis yesterday, but I didn't want to, for people to get in a trade where it is not yet confirmed. So I was waiting for this. So this was a double top. And again, I want to show you how OPT, I'm trying to show you how OPT can give you entry using 30 minutes we have done two hours we will look for one hour and then we'll go for daily weekly and then monthly so this video i just want to show you now this uh opt the one pattern this was gold yesterday if only you saw this double top i don't know comment down below did you see this double top on gold yesterday before the cpi news so i was telling my team and my students that we have the opportunity the market would sell. But then anyone who had entered gold, anyone who had entered gold, um, they were just, it was a 50-50 trade. Why? There was a pattern to either take the market or to drop the market or to take the market up. So this being our half, what I noticed on this, what I noticed on this double top was our half didn't have RBS. That was my first thing. So I knew for sure there is nothing, there is nowhere gold is going. It may, it may not be able to drop. So there was no RBS no rbs and rbs strategy is taught in details guys in the mentorship program you just need to buy that course to learn the whole module on rbs so the double top has two chances i keep telling you before even you go further let's go i have told you this is 30 minutes i don't want you to forget we are discussing opt so this is 30 minutes, guys. This is 30 minutes. We are trying to bring this uh, this uh, strategy to practice. So if you're on 30 minutes, what should be your what should be your overall goal? The 30 minutes double top not to be on one hour. So we go to one hour, guys, and it was not there. Even even if you go to two hours, it's not there. Even if you go to four hours, it's not there. You see, so the 30 minutes has so much power because we have the OPT, one pattern on one time frame. Guys, if you can listen to this video and agree to do what I'm telling you, for the first time, you'll make profits. For the first time, you'll make profits. You will make profits. So not having RBS. So I knew... It's either this market, at least it goes down, tap the half, and then maybe start to range at the half before we know what it wants, or breaks above. So I wanted to do this video one, once I was sure, because you will may tell people, I you tell people, this is my thoughts, and people trade with your thoughts and they over risk. So I said, I will not post until the market breaks there i didn't know the breaking was to be so huge for me i was on a buy already because i had i was trapped in previous trades so i was on a buy not willingly because i would not have entered so this market i wanted to tell people if you have to buy gold buy with a stop loss and put your stop loss where the market cannot hit you so like a hundred feet stop loss because you know gold can snap your stop loss and then proceed so we had that this market was like this. So let me show you what happened. So cap and handle, the market had two options, either to give us a cap and handle or to give a what? A complete double top. So these are a, a cap and handle. So for me, trading gold using OPT strategy really helped me because I knew the power of this double top. It was not even on the one hour. So let's see how the market moved. So the market continued to move um giving us green candle green candle but there is a place where it reached and i knew this market is gonna go up like here i even wanted to do that video this is was before the news and the market is still going up so can you see what has happened from where the market was standing for me i was waiting at least a small candle so that i can do the video but the candles moved to our take profit. We had to put our take profit at 1957 and the overall take profit was 1965. Gold moved. It never gave you an opportunity and it continued to move. And I believe the reason why gold had this big power is because even from a higher time frame, I used to analyze gold. It had a double bottom that was going and aiming to the neckline. So it was an easy trade. Buyers was a... Uh, 
an easy go for buying. So you see what has happened, a double bot, a double top on 30 minutes moving this market like this. So that's what I'm telling you. So if you want to see a double top, you can, and they can be either a double top or a double bottom. I was trading NSD, USD uh, some time back. This was NSD, USD, and I didn't know why this market was getting rejected. For me, if I, I open a chart and I'm finding my market at one place, I ask myself so many questions. Why is this market not moving past this area? You know, understanding OPT is very powerful. Why? Because I may not have a double top on four hour, but that does not limit me to go to two hours, one hour, 30 minutes. And that's the power of OPT, guys. If you can only know how much power it has. So I understand the market had broken a very major uh, resistance area, but here it is not, it's not like it is coming to get rejected here. Why is it stopping? And it stopped for almost... Uh, 24 hours like a whole day the market didn't move so i was concerned so i said let me go to two hours maybe i will find something why is this market stopping and as you can see on two hours there was nothing on two hours there was nothing guys can you see on two hours there was nothing so when i go to one hour guess what i find when i go to one hour this is what I find, guys. There was a resistance there on one hour. And I was happy. Why? Because finally, I have an example I can teach my students on YouTube that when you have a double a double top on one hour that is not on two hours, it's not on four hours, that OPT is magic. It will work hours, guys. So I heard that. So let me squeeze it so that we can see together. So it was... I, I was so excited by the way, just to find this. And you can see it has it has activated the double top. Because I was concerned, why is this market behaving this way? I was so much concerned. And for me, I knew if at all th there must be a reason why it is stopping. And you know, OPT gives you the chance to go and start looking. So the market had already activated. Now you need to understand one thing. The double top that we are seeing here, it is nowhere in other time frame. So we are not interested to go to 30 minutes. Once you find it on one hour, your interest becomes the higher time frame than one hour. If you find a double top on one hour, you can't go to 30 minutes. Most probably you will find it. But if you find it on one hour, you don't want to find it on two hours. You do not want. Can you see we don't have a green candle? We don't have a resistance. In fact, it is, cannot be on the daily, on the four hour. And if it's not on the four hour, do you think it can be on the daily? Surely it's not there. So that double top, imagine it was there planted on one hour. And you know, any pattern that we trade on one hour, we use here CSB. So from four hour, two hours, one hour, we are using CSB. We don't use WBB. So I'm trying to show you the power of OPT. If you can only if you can only agree with me that we need to practice this strategy, we want this strategy to be the best strategy that every beginner can take. Let people who come to Forex join the 5% of those people who win. We are tired of people coming to Forex and they lose money, they blow their accounts because they don't have a direction. Why can't we agree together that we will practice this and we start doing some things and we make OPT strategy very famous. Now, we look at current support, current support is there. So I was waiting for current support to break. So I wait, I wait, I wait. Notice it has not violated. If they violated this, you cancel the trade. It is no longer a double top. So I enter this trade, short position, and I was like, Let's see if this market will ever, and even give, I gave this trade, I was doing live analysis. If you can remember this analysis, comment down below. This is a live analysis I gave, guys. I gave this a live analysis. So the market dropped. Let's see how the market dropped. So this is an OPT on one hour. I have done 30 minutes I have given you with gold. And I love gold. Why? Because it will even go to 30 minutes and one hour a lot. And that one hour, it is with NSD, SD. Two hours we have done with gold. Now we will do four hours. And four hours is the just a trade we did the other day on GBPUSD. How would you not want to trade like this? Why would you want to stress yourself 
entering a trade that you're not even sure. The minute you have OPT, at least you have an advantage. It was to come to 88 pips. We want to see how this market ran. Did it hit our take profit? So what I can tell you is that you have to start practicing, making sure that you have OPT as your first edge, as your first strategy. You might open the chart and tell God, show me one pattern only on 30 minutes. And my goal, I don't want it to be on one hour. Or show me a pattern on four hours that I don't want it to be on, on higher time frame. So the market is going, trying to go, let faster knit. So the TP was hit. You can see the take profit was hit. And that was a very easy trade. When now we come to four hour, as I'm ending this video, we had GBPUSD, guys. GBPUSD was an easy trade. My goodness. You can see even my analysis. I will not even rub my analysis. This is my analysis, guys. Oh, the only thing I wanted here was to confirm that this double bottom on four hour, it is not on there. It is not on the daily. That's only that you need to check. If you check the double bottom on four is not on the daily, you are good to go. If you check the double bottom, um, it's not on the daily, you're good to go. So my double bottom was never on the daily. Can you check, guys? Was never on the daily. So I had a neckline. We will check together, don't worry. So these are double bottom that has happened yesterday. I'm not talking of 2020 or 2015 market i'm talking of recent market and i will do 30 back test i will do 30 live trades using opt for you to agree i i wanted when i was starting this video i wanted to do 30 back testing but i will do 30 live trades so i will be taking a trade i enter i show you i've entered i record i pause i when they reach 30 i will share that video as a proof that uh, that opt works so let's go to daily and check did we have a double bottom? Can you see? We don't have a support, guys. There is no support. So once you don't have a support, you just need to know that we enter using CRB. So for us to enter this trade is CRB. I would have given this trade earlier, but if you don't follow me on YouTube, that's why you're missing out. Why? Because every Tuesday is when I update my trades that I want to get involved in. So the trade was to, to get involved and to long position you get involved up, up to where? To the hub. It was that easy. And that's how our trade went by. So the, the trade continued to go up <coughs> and it hit our take profit. You can see our take profit was hit and the trade has continued to go up. In fact, this trade has gone up. It never gave us an opportunity to enter again because we are waiting for half to be broken, but it was a successful trade. If you check out USD, it was the same same thing. A double bottom that was never on the daily. There was never on the daily, but this one gave us an opportunity to enter. You see half was broken. I entered again. This trade, I'm already out because I don't like ranging market like this. So by the time I'm ending this video, it's just to tell you that even if you go to daily, you can still find... Let me tell you, the examples that I will give you guys, I will be recording and I will be recording these examples giving a live trade telling you today i traded this i want at least to have 30 trades that i have taken and this video you will be waiting for it i remember i was trading euro jpy a time back when we had a double bottom on the daily it is easier how this double bottom was so powerful and this double bottom the reason why i cannot forget it it's because we traded with the student so the half was around there that was our half guys around there you can see our half and then this was our neckline so i'm trying to show you past trades that i have taken using opt strategy it's not about like um doing back testing these are markets that i've entered so now we are going to daily understand i have taken you from 30 minutes one hour two hours four hour now we're on daily time frame so this is um an example, live examples that we did in class. Um, so already you go to weekly, you don't need to see that pattern on the weekly. Was it there? It was not there. So when you're in daily time frame, you have been given a buy entry. And let me tell you, long position, it was an easy trade because on daily we use what? WBB guys, we use WBB. So 
The second day, the TP was hit. It was a very easy trade. A double bottom that was not on another time frame. So when you go to weekly, I will use GBPUSD because that's what we have. So when you go to GBPUSD, you will find on weekly time frame, if you find a pattern, it should not be on the monthly. That's how the strategy goes. So we have a double top on the weekly time frame, and I have to put those yellow ellipse so that I can flip on the monthly and see it is not there. Guys, is it there? No. So when you have that pattern, when you have that pattern, oh, the only thing now you need to do is to look for entry. And I'm telling you, this is the best strategy you can ever see, you can ever do. You know, guys, I told you I will I will do a trade with 10 lot. This is the strategy, guys. This is what I want to use the 10 lot with. So we are waiting for WBB, a red candle, and then we check if it's bearish and gulf. Uh, it. So you come and put a box here. You have a red candle, you put a box here. And you wait if that candle will be, the box will be broken. So the box has been broken. No, it's not long position. It's short position. So the box has been broken. So instead of targeting half, you can even target to this zone because you can have a possible double bottom. So let's see what happens. The market drops, 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 and hit our TP and even go past our take profit. So what I'm trying to tell you is that there's power when you're doing trades like this. There's so much power. There's so much power. And now when you come to monthly time frame, you just need to find a monthly double bottom, a monthly double top that has given confirmation. That one is easier because if you have a double bottom on monthly and it has given a uh, direction, yes, you will use other time frame, but uh, from higher, from higher uh, time frame, you'll be told what to do. So you can see, uh, a double top like this, the market, if it gives a bearish end gap, it will just go down. So from the monthly perspective, it is even more confirmation because you can't move from the monthly. So that is it, all, guys. That is it for this uh, tutorial. I just wanted you to understand that there's power. There's power, guys. Um, there's power in this market. And more so when you're trading, uh, when you are analyzing the OPT strategy. For me, what I've come to realize is that when you use this strategy with one time frame, like there's somebody who told me to check USDCHF. Let's check it together. USD, USDCHF. And he was telling me to check it on four hours. I've just remembered. So I don't know what he saw on four hour. So this is what he's seeing on four hours. He was seeing this possible, can you see? He was seeing this possible double top, a uh, double bottom. But from what I can see, it was even violated. Can you see this candle was violated? It was violated. So if I go to daily, we might start to think, why is that market violated? Maybe it wants to come here. Because according to daily, the double, the double bottom can be on the daily, but if this candle breaks, and then we ask ourselves, will it be on the weekly? So you see, if this candle closes like this, this double top, the double bottom will be both on weekly, daily, for us. so for me, I would avoid such a trade. So something like GBPUSD, something like GBPUSD is easier to check on it. Why? Because if they activate, if GBPUSD, now I'm giving you current market, if GBPUSD activate this, it will be a OPT. So one pattern on one time frame. Why? Because this is our first attempt. And this one, it has not yet activated. It will be our second attempt. So if you want to start practicing this strategy right now, you have to go to the weekly time frame. So can you see we don't have a pattern? We don't have a double. We, have, we don't have a double top. So we will have a double top on the daily. If now they activate, it will be easier for us to trade. So for me, my eyes are on GBPUSD. And if I see something good, I put up on there. So let's see on, uh, on gold. What is gold telling us? What is gold telling us? So you can see gold, what we have, 
if this candle closes like that, it would have broken where? Place of possible double top on daily. But let's see if we have the possible double top on four hour. Imagine on four hour, gold can close like that and we can have a possible double top on four hour. Guys, this is huge. This is huge. If you have watched this video to this place, that's why God wanted you to remain here. Why? I'm giving you free signals. Free signals. Oh my goodness. Gold, if they close above that area on the daily, we have a confirmed double top that won't be on the daily. Why? Because you can see where four hour is. So we just need gold to close like that. So you have to wake up today uh, at 2 a.m. I, I think it will be tomorrow. So check tomorrow. Your goal is you want that candle to close at 1970. My God, may you make that candle to close like that. Why? Because if we flip on the weekly, there is nothing like a double top. There is nothing like a double top. And if we go to the monthly, there is nothing like a double top. You see, our double top is around here. So four hour is going to give us a possible double top. Already we have a current support. And it is an easy trade, guys. And the best thing, this double top can give us two things. A cap and handle or a complete double top. So you don't just think, oh, it will sell. No. Oh, my goodness. We have an entry, guys. We have an entry on gold. Oh, my God. So we just need to monitor gold. Even when I go to class, I'll tell them to monitor on gold. So gold uh, will... I will put it the blue flag because we need to monitor GBPUSD. Let's check out USD. So out USD on four hours, there is nothing that is stopping this market. Can you see? We don't have anything stopping this market. That's what the market looks like. Because if it is on four hours, that's it should go there. If it is to activate four hour, the double top should be like that. If it is to activate daily, the market has it activated daily? Yes, already. AUDUSD, you don't have uh, an entry. But let me tell you, on AUDUSD, when you go to monthly, if that candle closes like that, we got, oh my God. If this candle closes like this, we have an entry from the monthly time frame. Imagine having a double, double bottom on monthly. It means you have a swing trade. It doesn't mean that you enter immediately, but you have a swing trade. So our USD will be my overall. It will be going to 66. So if it closes like that, we have 158. But it, it, is, it is 15 days to close. So so many things can happen in those 15, 15 days. So uh, I will put it blue in color because that one needs more confirmation. So GBP USD. Uh, we have discussed about it. Euro JPY, uh, I have seen it has violated my, you see the way I was telling you guys that we can have a possible, we can have a possible double, Is am I on the weekly really? For 2008. So if this candle closes like that, it will have violated. And once they violate, there's nothing else we can do. So we have a possible way, a possible, it was there, it was supposed to be here. And we can see already it is at 163.80. So the question is, today is Wednesday. I want you to do this assignment for me. I want you to check if it has, uh, I want you to check if the market, I want you to check if the market will do what? I want you to check if this market will violate this double top. Because if they violate, we don't have, we don't have a pattern, a one pattern. You see, one pattern is very powerful for me more so. So we don't want the market to violate here. And you can see how that big candle is. But let me tell you, uh, Euro JPY. Okay, I will be doing analysis on Euro JPY, by the way, because they are very, very powerful. So I will not mix it up because it's different strategy. So our eyes are on this. We, we don't want that candle to close like that. 
In fact, we wanted to reduce with 100 pips or 90 pips for us to get a double top on only on weekly. Because if you check monthly, you do not have that double top. So I'm just giving you trades that are only on one time frame for you to go and practice them. You see, we don't have, there is no resistance here, guys. So today I'm not in a rush. If you have noticed, you're almost clicking one hour one hour in this tutorial. So I hope it won't be one hour we said. It will be a one hour on investing. You have to go back. You have to go back on those videos that are, are on those examples I have shown you. And it is your work to say, but then let me check this. Let me check this. Let me check for 30 minutes. Let me check one hour. So Euro JPY, it is a trade to eye on. So I will highlight uh the blue line so if i have if i highlight the dark blue it means it's on a higher time frame let's check month uh gbp gbp card so gbp card has really bought by the way it has bought it has bought and gbp card of course it has come to a zone where it has activated on the monthly so once the monthly has tapped that way I think we don't have much because it has tapped on the monthly, it has tapped on the daily, it has tapped, like it has tapped so many places. So unless with my student to use BW strategy, unless we use BW strategy, I don't think, I don't think this market will be giving us any trade. So let me just put it the dark blue to just caution us not what to do. So here on the on the USD, you know what I'm trying to do? I'm trying to give you trades to watch. You know, you can watch a strategy. If you don't practice, this information will not hold waters. So once you do this video, I am sending you to those trades that I'm showing you. So this is daily. <coughs> this is daily. So that's this is how our weekly looks like. It's just one candle. This is daily. The market is a sell. Um, this is four hours. So if you check for our, there is nothing that is making this market to just stop. You see, so we just need to understand, let it be not there is something hidden. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. USD card, we have a possible double bottom on two hours, guys. Just wait for that market to activate that possible double bottom you see these things you have to be intentional i have said let me take my one hour teaching these people these things so that if i don't I, if i post my results they won't say oh you are doing this so this market has a possible double bottom on two hours oh my goodness it is coming back to that area now you just need you just need to wait for the activation. The fact that it is on two hours, I cannot go to one hour because one hour I still I will still find something. You see, one hour I will I will find there's this zone on one hour. So we need to check on other if on other the brokers because the market can reject that area so as you're waiting on two hours it can it can go with one hour so this one i will do that uh, because it is not on two hours can you see you don't have it on two hours so that is it guys on 30 minutes uh let's see on 30 minutes what has happened it is on 30 minutes and two hours so we take one hour that area we are taking one hour. So if they happen to break that area, automatically will come to two hours. Again, USD card now, it is our, like every day we will be checking USD card, what is happening? NSD, USD, let's check you NSD, USD. So checking NSD, USD, it has really bought, it has really bought by the way, NSD, USD has really bought and it's going to the, uh daily to make a double top but the problem with nsd usd has a lot of zones so you can't know exactly what this market wants why because you can see on the weekly this is what we have a lot of weeks so nsd usd it won't be a good trade for us it won't be a good trade for us but you can see again on nsd usd on four hour there is a zone here so this market can 
if they don't break out there, we can attempt to trade to trade this one on four hour. So NSD, USD again, analyze it. Good opportunity. Good opportunity on NSD, USD. So, so that if we flip on the daily, it is not there. But remember on the weekly, it is there. So I don't know if it, it is a 50-50 chance trade. That one won't be as accurate as you might think. It won't be as accurate as you might think. NSD card, NSD card, NSD card. NSD card, we have to check from the daily, from the daily. So NSD card, what I'm, I'm seeing is that this is the daily. You can see this green candle in this big week. So the NSD card may be picking this daily double top. And I don't like it because already it, it was activated sometime. So let's check on the weekly what is happening. Oh my goodness, if they break there, they don't have another place. So NSD card just quiz to see if on four hours they will be activating something. So NSD card also it's a, an assignment I'm giving you. Euro USD, Euro USD, Euro USD has broken a very major resistance area and it's approaching on this zone. So the only thing we can check on Euro USD is it on the weekly. That zone is it on the weekly? Oh my goodness, it's nowhere. It's not on the weekly. So it's either we wait for this market to tap that area so that we can get a what? A double top. So again, we have a chance to check double top using daily time frame. Why? Because on the weekly, we won't have that double top. Can you see? So Euro USD, it has gotten to that area. So I don't think I have another one. I don't think I have another one because what I have now, they, are, they have already activated. So the pairs that you note, 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 the pairs that I've given you as an assignment, you can't do all this one hour lesson and you think you can go away free. So write down USD card, two hours. Check on two hours and wait for activation or one hour. Check if it won't violate trade one hour. If it violates, trade two hours. Euro USD, trade it on the daily. It has one pattern on daily. So all these trades have OPT. GBP USD, it has not activated, but you can have OPT on the daily. Gold, it has OPT on four hour. It has not given us confirmation. And then Euro JPY, I will do it separately because we really need it. Uh, we really need to see it happening thank you so much guys for watching i hope this one hour was helpful if you have reached to the end comment down i have watched this video to the end my goal is to give you a working strategy i'm promising you if you watch this video and you do the assignments your life will never be the same again bye bye and i love you god bless you